you know what could make me love any movie even more? If it had a dog in it, or pretty much anything in life is better with doggies. So Joanne Turnbull and Kathy Alexander are here to tell us about Doggy Shorts, Handy Dogs Benefit Furry Film Fest that's coming up. And ladies, I said I'm so happy uh, we're doing another because I know this uh, we did this last year. And so I said it must have went well because we're doing it again. Uh, tell me about the Doggy Shorts. Tina, it went very well last year. Um, we sold out the main theater at the Loft Cinema, and we are hoping to do that again this year. Uh, the Doggy Shorts, a furry film fest, is a special collection of, of short films uh, starring dogs. They are, oh, probably four to eight minutes long from all over the world. Uh, some are hilarious and uh, will really crack you up. Others are uh, met to warm your heart about the wonderful bond that all humans seem to have with dogs. And I'll tell you, a, 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 a movie of any length that tugs right. at my heartstrings about a dog, I'm going to need some tissues. So <laughs> I, I love those kind as well. And I know we're going to have all of these uh, wonderful films, these little shorts that we're going to be able to watch, but there's going to be more things going on at the event as well. Well, there, there certainly will be. Um, there is a silent auction that begins before the films do. Um, people have an opportunity to uh, buy a tribute for their pet um, so that the picture will be shown on the, the big screen there at the, at the loft before and during intermission. Um, there is also a, a local dog film contest oh. that we are having. So tell me more about the uh, local film uh, contest. We have had 19 entrants. Uh, the deadline has passed, so all of the entrants are in. The loft professionals are reviewing those films right now, and they will select, we don't know, maybe three or four uh, finalists that will be shown that night, included as part of our film festival. Oh, wow. And the audience uh, will choose. The audience that is there on April 8th will choose the winner. For and they, the did they also have to incorporate some kind of a dog theme of some sort? They do. They all <laughs> have to be dog related. They are four minutes or less and I haven't seen any of them yet but I have talked to the uh, person at the loft that is looking at all of them. He says some of them are about local dog programs. Uh, some are just really silly and fun films that people have created. Oh, and I know we mentioned also the dedication. How does someone let you know or get a picture to you if they would love to see their dog on the big screen because who doesn't? <laughs> That's right. Well, they can go uh, to the Handy Dogs uh, website, and they can also get, have a link there, get information about the tributes, um, and also uh, buy tickets online. Oh, perfect. I was just about to say that. That's how we get the tickets as well yes. as go online? Yes. I'm sure also going to the website is a, a great place to also get information about Handy Dogs so you can learn more about where the money is going. But tell me here, I know this is, I said this is a, a benefit for you guys. Where will this money end up going? Right. All of the money, the proceeds from this is going to Handy Dogs. We are a local nonprofit. We've been around for over 40 years and it's going to support our service and therapy dog training programs. So our service program is one where we teach people with disabilities how to train their own dogs to assist them. So it could be for mobility assistance, hearing alert, if they can't hear a fire alarm maybe, um, diabetic alert, a PTSD, and other physical and psychological challenges. So all of the money goes to a great cause and it helps that ongoing program. You guys do great work uh, in our community. And I know you guys have both, uh, I said you brought your own little nuggets with you uh, yeah. on your laps. Who did you guys bring with you today? This is Riley. Oh, and, and of course. And I've got Belle, who's sleeping. Well, and I, I didn't <laughs> recognize Belle because she's not wearing a ladybug uh, costume or anything. And I know she always comes in as a, a great support of Handy Dogs and everything uh, that you guys do. And so, website, great place for, uh, like you said, those tributes. It's also a place to get your tickets. It's mm -hmm. also a place to learn about Handy Dogs and anything that you guys might need beyond this event, correct? Correct. And I did want to hit before I let everybody go, we're going to see dogs on the screen. What about if my pooch wants to come and uh, join me for the event? Well, Tina, you have a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. <laughs> the main theater at the loft is being remodeled starting in May. So for this one time only, uh, if you purchase a special ticket, and you can find information about that on the website as well, uh, you may be able to bring your dog. There are a limited number of tickets, of course, for that. But this will be your one and only chance to bring your pet dog 
uh, to the Loft Cinema. Wow, what a great opportunity. Uh, like you said, a once in a lifetime. <laughs> we just happened to get the Loft at the right time uh, right. for this event. I have no doubt that this is going to sell out again. You guys have put together a really great event. So thank you ladies you. for coming in. Thank you. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> now doggy shorts will bark to life on <laughs> April 8th at 7 p.m. at the Loft Cinema. Doors open at 6 and to learn more, give them a call at 326-3412 or visit, like we were saying, handy-dogs.org.